Hey guys, my name is Metagross Freak, um, and before we begin this video, if you could in the comments please leave me uh, either who your favorite uh, Vault Hunter to play is, or which of the Headhunter DLCs is your favorite. Um, I'm going to use that uh, based on your results to try to figure out what to do next. Um, now I have a couple of uh, <laughs> soon after Valentine's Day I did a video with my level 50 ish gauge doing the uh, what was it what's this thing called a match made on Pandora which is the Valentine's Day slash Easter headhunter DLC uh, I am almost to level 56 on Krieg so I'm doing that now for you guys um, as you can see, I'm kind of combining his. I'm combining the Tiny Tina DLC head with um, one of the uh, caught with one of the the uh, the skins or him that has a he has a radioactive tattoo. I just realized that his bandages on um, this arm are caught are uh, like police tape. I just realized that it's kind of cool. Yeah, so I'm running a tank Krieg. I'll uh, do this for you. Um, I'm running a tank Krieg. My plan is to, after I max out um, Blood Trance, next level I got Blood Splosion, and then I'll just go, um, I don't remember what the names are, but the, the this lighter thing, Numbed Nerves, and then the thing that gives me uh, Fire Melee. Oh, sweet. Love is in the air. Now, for the most part, this is the exact same mission you'll have seen with the gauge video. The only real, the only difference is that uh, Krieg's responses are different from Gage's. I love Krieg's responses; his are hilarious. So, uh, sorry, Moxie, I don't mean to look at your cleavage. Let's begin. Ellie and I have waged war on the Zaffard and Hodunk bandit clans for years yep, now. Help. But it's time for peace. Hmm. Let's go talk to the preacher I hired. Oh boy, here we go. And don't you know having uh, an umbrella inside is bad luck, Moxie? Where is he? Oh, there he is. What a rough landing. Thankfully, I Ooh. like it rough. Tell him my plan, innuendo bot. Two star lovers, one from each clan, wish to be married. We will ensure their pairing and bring peace to both clans. My hat looks like a penis. Uh, noted. Anyway, Walter, the lovers are nearby. Follow me. I need you to protect the bride and groom so this wedding goes off without a hitch. If we do this right, we'll end the clan war for good. Hey, Moxie! I heard you're trying to get the clans to team up. You're making a mistake. If the clans unite, they'll just get even more powerful and take us all out. You gotta kill them. Violence won't solve this, L. We tried your explosive climax, but now it's time for my gentler touch. Oh, wait. You mean the climax I helped in? Yeah, you. Oh, the storm stopped. How about that? Maybe love really is in the air. Good luck. So, so let me get this straight, Moxie. You hired... The like most perverted robot in the world to help out a marriage. Uh, go in your cabin. Fine. I'll, uh, this is me shaking my head in disgust. All right. So for the most part. It's not too bad, but we got some thrushers right off the bat. We'll just take those out. It's time to go insane! Now, I, uh, I wish I had filmed it, but it was late at night yesterday. But uh, yesterday I soloed Terramorphus the Invincible using my uh, using my Tank Krieg build. Uh, Tank Krieg actually is not designed for for raid bosses. But the fact that I pulled it off means I know what I'm doing. Um, I 
think I can get I think it's a hundred fifty percent based on the items I have now. One hundred fifty percent damage reduction, which the uh, the cap is two forty based on um, a variety of items and math that I figured out. Um, though, believe it or not, damage reduction does not equal damage mitigation. So how it works is when you take damage, it's the dam it's that base damage. Colin. Great. I guess there's trouble in paradise, but we still need him to get married if the clans are gonna end the war. You can always just kill him. Thankfully, I know an old love potion recipe. We'll need something new, something old, something borrowed, and something that, gold. That doesn't sound right. Ooh, I just found something that'll take care of half of them ingredients. Vault Hunter, head to these coordinates. Booyah! Yeah, good job, Ellie. Shut up, Bridget. If you help me as much as you love that job, So, uh, you, if you really want to listen to this, you can listen to it on my other video. Um, let's talk about, yeah, so damage. So let's say you take a thousand damage. Um, how it works is it's a thousand, that'd be a thousand damage, then, then it counts in uh, damage reduction. So it'd be, it's divided by one plus the percentage in his decimal form. So like if, for example, I get 50% uh, from Release the Beast and up to 80% from Taste the Blood and an additional, um, uh, let's see, where is it? 20% from the Rough Rider. And if actually I should change over my relic just to show you guys, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just round, round down and say it's about 20% from uh, my resistance relic. So combined, that's 170, actually. Um, so 170%, which becomes 1.7. So combined, you have 2.7. So even though I have 170% damage reduction, I don't take negative damage. Instead, it's 1,000 damage divided by 2.7, which, let's just say for argument's sake, I rounded up to 3. Um, at 170-ish damage reduction, I uh, only take a th about a third of the damage, which is nice. So um, all throughout the area, I don't. I'm probably not going to do. The, I might not do all these, depending on uh, how I end up doing. But there's these cool fish you can pick up and put them on these lines to pull out special threshers. Uh, as you may have seen in the, the gauge video I did doing this. I'm mostly doing this because I like Krieg's responses to certain things. I love Krieg, he's awesome. Really? Where's my thresher? There he is! Okay, so this is the white, the white rarity thresher. Uh, he's just a normal special looking, actually he's just kind of a an alternate colored Groper Thresher. Uh, nothing too special about him. You could easily take him down. And then with all the Threshers, um, you'll be able to place him on this bounty board over here to unlock this special chest. Uh, so here we go. As you can see there, I have the Groper Thresher there. And there are four more. So, it, as you can see, all of these Hodunks are uh, allies to me right now, which is really nice. I don't. I, it's nice to see that even after I kick the tar out of them, is that they don't a baby? Hate me. All right, real talk. Babes are new, right? And he's not yours. So if you take him for a little while, he's borrowed. Huh? Huh? You're suggesting we throw a stolen baby into a potion. <laughs> what? No, we ain't gonna hurt him. Just kidnap him. Okay, hold on. Before we do that, I'm gonna grab with a green bait. I'm trying to see if there's anything. Oh, that's right, there's a car over here. 
a car chest, whatever these things are called. I'm just gonna call them car chests. Ooh, nice. Wait, wait, let me check that sniper rifle. 3.4, high crit chance and high chance of slag. I'm gonna test this out, hold on. I'm gonna, uh, before I grab the baby, because I really don't want to grab the baby at this very moment. What do they call him? It just says baby. Um, I'm going to do the uh, this the green rarity thresher, and uh, I want to use this. This is kind of like a almost like an SFG kind of assault rifle thing, based on the way it works. Uh, you don't usually see slag percentages that high on flat on a on flat off weapons. So I might want to use that. It's kind of nice. Alright. So the green rarity thresher you feel up here is a just a normal spike thresher. I think he actually might have some of the wormhole capability. Uh, I'm not Oh yeah, see, called it, called it. He's a wormhole. Uh, I don't know. I pressed the wrong button. Sorry, Icarona. You're dead. So we have a, a groper thresher, a wormhole thresher. Three more to go. I believe there's one of each type. Oh, and for some reason, if you guys are really into opening mailboxes, all of these open. I guess for some reason. Hey, cool. Iridium. Need some iridium. Okay. That's nice. I might save this. If I decide to not stop using magic missile for some reason. Gundam style. Hold on. Oh, his name is Charles. It's adorable. Hey, it's uh, Tector. It's Hector. It's a Scarlet Swatch! Now, I do like it how this uh, this DLC does not reference, I it references the clan war, but doesn't say who won. So no matter which side you took, you could. this is still canon. Um... I always personally do the Zaffords, mainly because, well, I think the Zaffords are better, and I like their uh, their end uh, and the uh, I like their end of the the, the, the the end reward better, which is a uh, SMG that does both shock and slide. It's really cool. Berserk on you if you want. This is the part where, once we meet Ed, this is the part where we can start getting cool responses to things. Cool little Cree dialogue. Looks like the distillery shut up tighter than an abstinence advocate and an orgy. But one of those poor slave bots got locked out too. Maybe talk to him? Sup, Ed. Woe is me. My beloved girlfriend bot sleeps away inside the distillery. Aww. And I cannot save her due to my pre-programmed self-esteem issues. Aww. That loader should be strong enough to bust open the doors. Why don't you give him some words of encouragement? Okay, here comes the first one. She's waiting for a suckle at the teeth of explosion chivalry! 
<laughs> what? You know what? You're right. Let's go save my girlfriend. Engaging chivalry protocols. Yeah. Chivalry. Not really how it works, but okay. Okay, you actually need to stay near Ed, because due to his self esteem issues, if you ditch him, he does not move. Luckily, he doesn't take any damage, even though he's absorbing most of these bullets here. It's kind of nice. Hey, pick up the base. All right. That's stuff to do. I got crushers to kill. Break through the walls, I'm done. Look at that laugh. Dude just busted the wall. Okay, well I don't normally, I'm not a big fan of drinking, um, I think the, the dialogue that all the characters have is hilarious, um, especially if you've seen my video with Gage, one of her lines is, since the drinking age in this place is probably birth, I guess this is alright. <laughs> so here you go, the first one. Third time to try, right? Mother's milk! <laughs> mm, that's the stuff. Grab some of that whiskey and we'll get to the next ingredient. Look, 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 look. Alright, we've got new, old, and borrowed. You'll need to find some gold. There's gotta be some around here. The Zaffords are as greedy as they come. Wait, is there an invisible wall here? Come on. No! Dang it. I wanted to go the other way just for fun. Huh. Dead end. You'll have to find a way through. Allow me, Volta, sir. It's the least I can do to repay you. Bye, guys. Have fun doing kinky robot things. There. Your nearest stash of gold coins. Grab a few and we'll have everything we need for the potion. Oh, gold Zaffer coins. The Zaffords are real protective of their cash. Gold coins. The gold's probably booby trapped or something. That's totally not a stereotype, guys. I find Irish stereotypes funny. Because being Irish and I'm not Irish. I, I, I'm Irish and I do not follow any of the stereotypes. <laughs> Stop attacking me, I won't kill you. I just lost my oh, Let's go. Look, drunk fresh airs. I need to get an orc. I don't. This SMG is not doing it for me. Okay, there actually is another one of the uh, the baits over here, so you want to keep your eye out for that. 
can't remember where it is. I think it's in the. I think it's oh, like over. The, it's right, right, right over there in the corner. High quality. Can I sell some of the stuff I've got here? No uh, okay, I'll do that for now. Right. Let's roll. Oh boy. Okay. Blue rarity thresher bait. Just now you know where it is. It's something cool. All right, so my spread eagle man. Well, that's new. Oh, I couldn't shoot him. Wait, wait, wait. What? How did I take damage? Hold on. Good thing I have my rocket launcher out. Jeez. How did I take damage from that? I killed two bots in one. Cool, I did. I'll show you what a badass is. Uh, uh. Silly thrushers, tricks are for kids. Hey, I'm drunk. Drunk Krieg. Drunk Krieg is best Krieg. Close range shotgun to the face. Well, there you are. So blingy bling motor. And if you can, you want to try to like, delay killing him as quickly as possible. Because he drops money. Oh, wait. Is there a mini loader around here? Oh, there is. It's adorable. Look at it, your little mini loader. He's dead now, but there was a mini loader. baby loader. So cute. Now he's dead. Okay, now, story-wise, when you kill the Thresher, he drops purple bait. Um, however, normally, if you guys are just farming it, it's found in that bucket. You can just come over here and go, whoop, pick it up. Okay, I'm good loot. Something gold. Here we go, another funny greed line coming up. Seriously, this right here, this is not something good guys do. YOLO! Never say that again. Now, let's mix it up. For the record, you sh no one should ever say YOLO. Except for uh, Dacker Cloud. Because, you know, he's awesome. 
Mixy, mixy, mixy. Sounds mix. like the love potion's mixing as we speak. Hey, with all this talk of marriage, I'm curious. Was there ever a Mr. or Mrs. Vault Hunter in your life? Yeah, the tiny one, and the sad-faced mother, and the blue tattoo forever and ever. That's looking well. Before I go on, I'd like to point out, I would assume that he's talking about the other Vault Hunters, the small one being uh, Salvador, the, what he said, the sad-faced one, I'm assuming is uh, probably Axton in the blue in the blue tattoo. I'm assuming is Maya. Um, if you don't believe me, there's a lot of people that ship Maya and Krieg. You could also explain it as um, Lilith, Mordecai, and Brick, because Mordecai is physically small, shorter. Uh, Brick is like kind of solemn all the time, and Lilith being a uh, Lilith being the blue faced one. Or, you know, the small one could be Tina. Yeah, t be Tina and uh, Maya. And I don't know who the sad faced one would that be, but you, know, you, could, you could ship them with a lot of things. It'd be funny. Now, just turn on the machinery to distill it. Those are my head cannons there. What, that's not how alcohol works. Looks like the potion's done. Grab it. Alright, better deliver that silly ass potion and do the dumb marriage. And give the baby back. Yeah, whatever. Do the thing. Yeah, I like how they actually have to make return baby a mission objective. We actually have two more threshers. We can uh, farm. So I'll do that before I go on with the, uh, the mission. Calm down, man. Okay. I should do these in order. Purple bait first. Also, there's loot. While we wait, purple bait. Blue bait. Purple bait's up there. Okay, I'm not sure if it pulled him. Is he up yet? I think this is the pirate thresher. Oh no, it's still going, okay. I'd like to point out that these, uh, these guys are just reskinned bandits like the <coughs> most like you probably just heard psycho talk there we go there he is there's the big guy so there's a moby moby's one of those big freshers with all the fancy tennis tennis balls Oh, if only I had the Ahab. That'd be a little ironic. Killing Moby with the Ahab. Alright, let's do this purple bait. Highly advanced bait. 
Oh, I missed. Thanks. Sorry, Threshers, I ain't gonna work. <coughs> And of course, here comes the Pyre Thresher. I actually really hate these guys. They refer, refer to this guy as the Fire Kraken. Like a jerk in a box. Never stop the killing! Never! At least he offers up a good amount of experience for being a pain in the butt. Alright, first off, want some ammo, and we're almost good to go. We have one more bait to go, but we won't get that for another minute. Okay, so don't forget, there's uh, these two chests over here that those don't unlock until after you beat the boss. <laughs> Thank you. We've moved the wedding into the fresh air. Yeah. Just put the potion in the punch bowl and we'll get started. Cool beans. <clears throat> oh, in case you guys are interested, the skin and head you unlock The head is a bone daddy, which, as you can see, my face is all peeled and skeletal and gross. And the uh, do I have do I have the do I have this one yet? Oh, that's right. I don't have the uh, I don't have the the skin for this. But the skin has a uh, an Irish theme. The one I used the one I have on on Gage I used to use for a while, but I got the uh, the Halloween one for her. It makes basically. It's Green and black stripes, basically. Can't fool me. This is Tector. I recognize ah! him. I ain't gonna drink that. Of course you would, you coward. The hell I am. Ah, who's yelling now? I ain't let no whole dumb princess out drink me. Hell no. Good effort. Be a stereotype. Say, you look pretty good all of a sudden. The secret to beating these guys is don't kill just one of them. You want to weaken both of them. 
Oh my god, oh my god. You want to weaken them both, that way you can take them out around the same time. Because if you accidentally kill one, um, they'll try to revive the other. That is... Dang it, no, no, crap. Okay, where is, where is he? I don't need to heal. Okay, hold on. Okay, he's fast, he's fast. fast. Come on, come on, come on, come on, kill, 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 kill him. Yes! There we go. Yeah, that was actually the fastest I think I've killed the two of them. Okay, is there gonna be the balloon here? I don't remember if the balloon shows up. On subsequent visits, a large hot air balloon full of loot appears, providing you with all of the fancy stuff. I'm sorry by the way for this lag, I don't know, if, don't know why I'm liking Creek. Stop freaking yelling, jeez. Shiny soul stabber. As you can see, the uh, orange thresher bait, legendary thresher bait. This is the uh, the master of all baiting. So, if you know you want to be a baiting master, you should definitely pick up some orange bait, so you can be a baiting master. It's a, it's a very awesome profession. Almost dead. Ah, I can fix that. I think I should get a high five for that, by the way. <laughs> Considering I said that with a straight face. I'm just going to sell this stuff we have here. Um, I like this one specifically because I like this specific DLC because it's not too difficult to do. Um, especially because like for the Halloween one, the the uh, the Halloween one and the uh, the Christmas one, and to extent even the uh, what was the other one, the Thanksgiving one. You have to do this long walk. Well, instead for this one, it's basically just like, whoop, it's a short, it's still a good little walk, but it, it's, it's, it's a short little walk. It's not as bad. And these guys actually drop some pretty decent loot on subsequent visits, but first, loot. More loot. Oh, really? That's it? Okay, sure. What else? Okay, and if for some reason you didn't have it already. You'd be able to get trying really hard to find a moral to the story other than violence is good, but uh it's not it's, it's not coming. Yeah. And just for the to complete the DLC, there's some more lines that come out. Talk to innuendo bot. Let me check make sure I didn't forget anything. Is that actually like a Bible Bible? It's just like a book, I guess. I guess they didn't want to offend anyone with a church. You had me at go away. <laughs> Corruption detected activating romance.exe. Sexy things are overrated. It is time for love. You will collect romantic gifts while I put words of romance into an echo recorder. First, fetch me a cigar. The Hoda Bridesmaids may have some. Okay. 
as you probably will notice, I am really close to leveling up here. How much do I need here? I actually I need less than 500. So I think I'm just gonna get the uh, orange, the orange no. rarity thresher no. first, just so I can no. potentially level up. Either way, before this video is done, I'm leveling no. up, which is awesome. Hi guys. Hello chat. Okay. So this last thresher is a little weird. He's uh pretty big. It's time to go insane. To say the least. Oh yeah, I forgot to mount the others. One more thresher to go. I'm going to take these guys out really oh. Oh, wow. oh, hello. Is this Thresher? There he is. Rue the Love Thresher. He's got like a like a tie or sideburns or something. And a little hat. I think he has a mustache too. Oh, really? I've never seen this guy before. Holy cow. That's cool. I've never seen this guy before. Where is he? Oh, you're mean. The Clemson Jets fill me up. I have never seen that guy before. That's cool. Look at all this money he dropped. Freaking sweet. I'm sorry if I totally got distracted there. I was just really excited because a leprechaun appeared and said I would never catch him. I wanted to prove him wrong. So wait, that was the last Thresher. Um, I do think it was a little lazy that they combined Valentine's Day and St. Patrick's Day and Easter. Actually, well, no, technically they haven't done Easter yet. That's right, Easter's coming out. Because of the uh, Son of Cromorax DLC coming out. Sorry, they combined St. Patrick's Day and Valentine's Day into one. Um, I think they could have, you know, just made them a little shorter. Um, oh, well. Oh, that would have been really cool if I had gotten, like, a legendary or something from this guy. I'm getting all psyched now. I want to, like, see if I can come back here later and get some cool stuff. Here we go. Just leveled up. I am now level 56, which means actually my Krieg is higher level than my gauge. By one, but still. So, I, I joke you not, you put down all five Threshers and it just gives you access to this chest. Which, surprise, surprise, oh wow, actually that was, that was different. I normally do not get the Iridium stuff. The iridium and gold, that's kind of nice. So, 
Yay, points. Alright. Put that point in and now I can get blood explosion. <sighs> Which once I get blood explosion, that'll make make do that'll make uh killing everything a lot easier. In case you were wondering, that does say Noggin Funker. Uh, the first time I read that, I thought it said something really bad. So... Probably that wasn't the best idea for them to name things. Mean something. As people are running by with axes and guns. How do you know I'm gonna steal your cigars? I haven't done anything wrong. Also, why are all the bridesmaids like guys apparently? You can't fool me. In case you guys didn't know, these balloons, you can destroy them to get loot. Well, mostly ammo and money, but it's still kind of nice. Let's see here. So, a cigar. I don't always smoke cigars. But when I do, they're made by hold-ups. Right, My old self would have made a phallic in the window when he grabbed the cigar. But my lovelorn heart was burning, sir. Now collect a blonde wig. You may find one in the Zapper distillery. Confession. When I look at Moxie, I feel a sharp pain in my hypothetical stomach. Though she is my mother, I feel an intense love for her. Is this normal? Don't ask me to show you normal! Krieg, you're the best. <laughs> I love Greek. Hey guys! I'm a terrible person. I mean, you let go of the not the big man! Everything! Stella? No! I really wish you had seen it. It doesn't take that much of imagination to know that. Which holds existence together. Oh, I see what's going on. And you end up out and a few romantic comedy vids off the Echo Net. They may have scrambled his AI. Okay, before I collect this grease. Get this out of the way. Yes, most of my merchandise was ripped from the hands of dead adventurers. It's okay, most of mine is too. <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking, maybe the reason all of Marcus's weapons suck is because I'm selling him all these crappy items. Yep. Okay. God damn it, Seal! So, uh, 
So, uh, guys, how many people were in your circle, jerk? Stop them! They've got the sacred man grease! <laughs> the sacred man grease. Hey. You gonna squirm? <laughs> it's shot. Nobody killed my buddies but me. You. Well, guys, that was fun. This grease will come in handy at error and error. Return to me so that I can rampage and heal, heal and rampage. Initializing, nagging, Okay, you guys saw that, right? I just got a Gunnerang. Sweet. I love getting legendaries. Okay. I totally want to check this out, but I'm going to wait until after this is done. Uh, doesn't really like all that special, though. It's just kind of a normal pistol, I guess. We'll check this out. Poor Stella, she's dead. Negan.exe. Sup? Okay, now, I think from what I remember, the Gunnerang is just like a normal TDR, but it comes back to you if it like misses or something. So, I'm interested in checking that out. You are pretty, but your hair looks like a drowning burn victim. Wear this wig and love me forever. Um, no. Wait. Acknowledged. Take the second Valentine to Zaffer, comma, Nathaniel Lim, and we will woo him with pure bloodness. But she's already blonde. <sighs> Stupid robots. You, uh, you okay in there, Thresher? Marry me immediately. Ah, I'm good. Understood. We must now attempt the nuclear option. Bring the last Valentine to Moxie, that I may pour out my heart and soul to her. Dear God. You really don't want to be Moxie's like fifth husband, dude. She's oh. a, she's nice, but no, no. See, I love you. You're so great. I am sorry. I know now that love cannot be forced. Complete your mission and end my heartbroken existence, Vault Hunter. Oh, maybe leave him alone. Sounds like he's learned his lesson. Open your mouth 
I'm prepared to receive my payload. Oh my god. Terrible oh, combat yes, yeah. Come on back, Vault Hunter. Terrible fun to stop EXE. So lucky. That's the last time I let him watch romantic comedies. Oh. <laughs> and with that, that is the uh, the DLC with Krieg, which is pretty awesome. Um, if you were to come back in. You'd be, of course, be able to fight Bridget and Colin again, and like I said, all the the, the various Thresher baits would be around the map if you wanted to collect those again. And now I know about that Leprechaun guy. I want to go like beat him up, to get tons of money. That'd be awesome. He's crazy fast though, so I'd probably need like Maya or uh, either Maya or Zero or something. I'm trying to keep up. God, he was so fast. Okay. So, that was fun, and I hope you did too. I hope I had fun too. Sorry. <laughs> um, so, until next time, I'm Metagross Freak, and you guys have been awesome. So, thanks for watching, and have a good one. Bye.